If you look at a period of time and you look at the number of cases of a virus in a community over that time, if a lot of people get sick all at one time, that means a lot more people that are sick, that are accessing the emergency room, doctor's offices, hospitals, etc. Instead, if you employ practices that reduce the spread of that virus, then you could have people, instead of all getting sick over a matter of days or weeks, they get sick over a matter of multiple weeks, and it spreads the impact of a virus on the community. What we want to do with COVID-19 is we want to prevent the virus from spreading in the community, and here's why. There can be an individual that shows no symptoms or signs of having COVID-19, and there can be another individual that is perfectly healthy. And to prevent the virus from spreading from the individual who has the virus but has no symptoms to the other individual, we want to keep them as far apart as possible. That's why it's so important in social distancing to avoid large crowds, avoid restaurants, avoid bars, avoid um, uh, movie theaters, concerts, any place where large number of people aggregate, we need to avoid those right now to prevent the spread of this virus. The outdoors is its very safe place to be right now with your kids. So while they're home, it's great for them to have playtime outside. But if there's a proviso here, you need to avoid playing with other kids so that the virus cannot be spread from individual to individual. You stay calm, stay vigilant, and stay home. You are all contributing right now as a family to help reduce the burden of COVID-19 on everybody else. And I thank you for that. <laughs>